Miss Grace today. I'm going to read the Bible story. The Bible title is 18th chapter. Jesus healed a blind beggar. Luke 18. Uh, before I read this, I will revise the story. Yesterday's story was 17th chapter. Children meet Jesus. Mark 10. The children's parents wanted to bless their children. But the disciples said, go back, Jesus is so busy. And suddenly Jesus has came and asked what is happening. And his parents said, your disciples are not allowing us to go near you. Because you're so busy. Do not keep them all. You just said, don't keep them away. Little children, only like these little children can enter the God's kingdom. Jesus' disciples were telling, Jesus doesn't have any time, but he have put on them Jesus lap and tell many stories about God and about the house of God, heaven, and how much God loves them. We should be like the God's children. Yes, today we are going to read 18th chapter. Jesus healed a blind beggar. Luke 18. Jesus was in Jericho, Jericho. A poor man sat on the street. He wanted people to help him. He was blind. He couldn't work. He couldn't get food to eat. His name was Bart. He, Neus, he was blind, sign, he was born. He was begging in front of the temple. So, there was one man called Bartimius. And he couldn't see, and, and he was back. And he wanted to people help him. And and he was just born like that with the life. Yes, there's a question. Who is Bartimius? Bartimius. Who is Bartimius? He is a blind man and he is a beggar. Okay? He is a blind man and he is a beggar. He heard people asking, What's going on? Jesus of Nazareth is passing by. But the man heard about Jesus, so he shouted, Jesus of Nazareth, help me, help me. He shouted to Jesus. People scolded him, Hey, be quiet, please. Why are you shouting so loudly? But he shouted more loudly, Help me! Help me! So, before he have all heard about Jesus many times. So, I think he really wanted to meet Jesus. They were there only. And you just 
came and somebody asked, what's going on? Why are you, why there's so many people here? And one people said, he just had of Nazareth is passing. So he was so excited because he can like heal his ma. So he was shouting and shouting. But the people has scolded him. Don't shout. But like that days he were if the people scolded him he was he stopped it shouting. But this time he was keep shouting. When he was shouting, the people was saying to him not to shout. What did he do? He didn't shout. Question. Answer. He shouted more loud. He shouted more loud. Bring him to me, said Jesus. The people helped. Bartimaeus to come to Jesus. As he came to Jesus, he asked, What do you want me to do for you? So he was so shouting, Jesus heard that voice and said to the people, Bring him to help me. So the people helped him. To go because Jesus said, and Jesus asked, What do you want me to do for you? I want to see, said Bartimaeus. Will you see? You will see. Your faith made you see, said Jesus. Right after Jesus said, so the man could see, but was very happy. So he have gone, and but and Bartamin said, "I want to see." And when he have said that, his eyes. He could see again, and he just told him, "You, your faith made you see." Okay, that is an important part. What did he make to see again? What did he? No, what did with? What did make to see again? With thing made methamine to see again? Bait. Oh, sorry, the spelling is wrong. Bait. Yes, right. Faith can make everything. Not everything. And Bethany could see the trees. He could see the people. He could even see Jesus. Thank you. Thank you, shouted Bethany happily. Bethany wanted to go with Jesus. He wanted to help Jesus. He realized that Jesus loved him. He loved Jesus very much. Yes, today I read the Bible story. 
and tomorrow, next time, I will read my tea topic. A short man named Zacchaeus looked 19. Yes, today I read the Bible story. Did you like it? Then bye! This is something sticky. Bye.